Hi, I'm Lynn Hunsaker with Clear Action Continuum. Continuity is the third key after curiosity and costs for buy-in, engagement, and customer-centric culture across your firm. Continuity means connecting to what works in your culture, making things continuous for people to add to their daily routines without actually adding something to their plate. So start with a look at what works in your culture as far as initiatives that have been launched, new things that have been part of what employees must adopt to do their work or to get approvals. What kinds of things worked well? What kinds of roadblocks, workarounds, and resistance were part of those things? Learn from that and continually keep your radar out to adopt those things that work well in your culture. Continuity also means making sure that you understand every stakeholder's routines and lingo and how they think where they're at right now. Meet them where they're at and design your reports, your presentations, your conversations to tie in to what they're doing, what they're pursuing, and what's, what kinds of pressures they're facing, what's important to them. That's continuity. Especially pay attention to what your CEO is talking about. What are your overall objectives for your corporation? What are the strategic pillars and stretch goals? How does your CFO look at ROI and what's important financially? How are marketing, business development, and sales talking about customers? Which customer segment is the most important for driving your growth this year? You really need to address customer experience, data collection, reporting, engagement, and value in terms of that group of customers. Report similarly to the way that those customer facing groups are reporting. Adopt their formats, talk in their language, and don't require them to learn your lingo. All they really need to know is what's really happening with customers and what do they need to do about it? When I use this approach leading CX company-wide, I started out with the account teams and the engineering teams, and then I branched out to the support functions. It was really important to tie in to what they were already doing and present customer experience insights and suggestions as a tweak to what they were doing modifying their mindset, their timing, their quality, their handoffs, their policies. These are modifications that can make all the difference in throwing less things over the wall to customers, customer service, and churn. So remember, focus on curiosity, costs, and continuity as the first three keys to driving buy-in, customer-centric engagement across your company, and customer experience maturity.